G'day, welcome back as I continue on playing Cold of the Lamb. Uh, and I suppose I probably have to go... Oh no, I don't have to, to go back and beat that guy again, I guess. I'll say hello to this guy. Now I'm going to make him... Same as the other guy. We'll make him in a different colour, just to give him some variety. Um, you don't have to have a scar either. And what we will do is we will give you the job of uh, worship as well, which is why we've made you a devotee. I want to say dear, that dear. So let's go in here and have a look at making a doctorate. Assume I've gone to the right place. Find out soon enough, but we may as well get through our daily sermon. So more variety of curses. Main weapons, yeah sure, let's since I generally base weapon hit stuff a lot more than I use curses. It seems like that's the uh, the better option. unhappy with that. Okay, so this is our doctorate. Use command stone to declare a new doctorate for your cult. So I guess we're starting with this one. Okay. Alrighty, so I'm gonna need bones to do that. I assume that is that where the ritual then comes in? Right, okay, so we now need to get bones so that we can come back in here and do a ritual. Right, so back to back to a bit of fighting, see if I can not die this time. Make some bones. As you were, fellas. Go back to It was seven was our um our next level, so we're on four at the moment. So still a little while till we can break into that one. Go pick a fight with these little guys again and See if I can win it. Okay, bone dagger. A little bit of poison on this guy. It's a very short range, but at least it's a quick hit. Violent, violent eruption of tentacles. Cool. Alright. Fun little story. Once I, I my uh, my wife occasionally talks in her sleep. Not very often recently, but um, uh, in the past she she had, and I learnt that I couldn't question whatever she was asked saying. Like if she was saying something weird, I couldn't say, "What are you talking about?" Well, that doesn't make any sense. Like she would um, or try and like bring logic into what she was saying. And eventually, I realised that the best way was that I just had to talk her through. The dream that she was having so i just had to agree it basically was like improv you always say yes and uh and once she said she won't while sleeping she said what's that and i said what and she said that up on on the roof and i said oh what is it and she goes red and tentacles and i said oh but it's not there anymore is it and she said no and then fell back to sleep and then i was left awake thinking what is on our roof <laughs> Alrighty, so we've got that room done. We've got a nice little selection and Poison does seem to have a bit of a nice effectiveness to it. 
All right, so bit this way. Reveal the map, reveal, deals poison damage to enemies struck. I think I'm already doing that, but I wonder if it'll double down on it or anything. Or, I mean, not every single hit with this this thing is um is doing damage, so. Or doing poison damage, rather. Possibly there's double poison damage there, I can't fully tell. Either way, we seem to work through guys pretty quick. Um, I wonder what the value of doing a question mark is. And there's nothing about the weapons in the second round that makes it seem like I'm better off or worse doing anything, so we may as well go for a... Uh, go for an extra guy. The bones to collect here too. And I, I think in good taste I didn't collect those bones till after he was left. He'd left. I don't mind this weapon too, so let's um... They do offer me another one, I might not take it. Get everyone poisoned. I'm lacking this weapon. My, I guess my poison buff is coming along with it. get everyone already poisoned so they can sort of keep away even when I'm looking at other guys. I mean I haven't used my current one, but I will I will stick with it. My current um ability that is. weapon the stagger to really get in there and just do some damage. Alright, here we go. Let's see if we should hold up better than we did last time. I gotta remember to actually steal the devotion first before I just start beating him up. By one stone. The, um, the poison definitely makes my just roll around defensively sort of play seem to work better. Um, because you basically just delaying doing anything once they've already been hit and poisoned is still playing in your favor. That um that fire one on me. That's also got a chance of poisoning. That's a level two one, so let's go for that. Give me a bit more range. time. Alright, not gonna get me again. 
So I think I've just got to stand really far away when he does that. So I am right in that gap. Then wait for him to do this one. Then hold on him till he uh till he jumps because he's always going to just jump away anyway. So it's not like he's going to surprise me with his his AOE one. And all I gotta do is just move around. Ah, I moved too quick on that one. Ah, that time I pressed giant attack instead of jump. The problem that I'm doing here too is that I'm I'm not I'm sort of jumping before he starts shooting. I need to have um I need to be on like an edge of him because then I can so like say here and as long as I know he started then I can. Start to move towards him as soon as he fires the first one, as opposed to having to wait till he uh till he's done. Oh, whereas this time I went the wrong way. I can use that ability as well to slap him to speed things up. Hey, buddy. Let's take a follower form. I mean, the other two seem like they're just something I can go continue to collect. So there, I can see at the top there, there was two things on the door, which suggests, I guess, that, um... If I need smash through that, like, two more times, then I can open up another section in there, too. Or I skipped through that, because I was hoping that pressing it would reveal all text as opposed to skip to the next one. Alrighty. Alright, we're back, kids. We should have two new guys, so what we'll do is we'll change this guy's form to a rabbit, and the other guy was yellow, so let's make this guy blue. And we'll say to this guy, we go up some wood. Hey buddy, how you doing? Ah, what's the name of the cult? Cult of the Lamb. Can I edit that? And all right, let's aptly call us Drawing Dead. All right, so you, we are going to make a fleshy monster. Was the other guy? The other guy was green, so you can be pink. Uh, and you go and do some stone cutting. Notice that I can't just ask anyone to do to go collect berries. It does seem like some of them are doing it anyway, just because this is full. I mean, sounds like we've got to start at least with. Unstable sleeping bags. Should I find inspiration at that cost me? Probably want to get a farm plot nice and quick too. Body pit. Oh, hopefully we don't need a body pit just yet. Let's get our uh, farm plots going.
All right, we're nice and close to another upgrade as well. It is day three, so let's go in and form another sermon. We're going to do the ritual, so we can now get that done. Blessing once a day. You can also give him gifts, complete quests. Okay. Alright, so let's go. Oops. No, sorry, I want to speak to Hano. So I don't have the ability to give him a blessing yet. Give blessing. Hmm. All right, our other huh? rabbit. I don't remember which one of those two options it sits under. Good. Where are they, guys? Uh... Everyone gets a blessing. Give gift. Okay. So let's go give a gift to uh, Hano since he's been around the longest. Do I have any gifts? Oh, yeah, the necklace. We're um, waiting to. Let's get some. Let's see if we can get some uh, farming done. So we'll build our farming down in front of the temple. Sure. Does it tell me how many we got? Oh, 16, 116. Okay, so we go. How many people have we got? Six at the moment. So let's double down. Go. 12. And then we'll go beds, and we'll put the beds up near where we are, have the um, cooking area. So we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. So I don't know if I um, if I just have to wait till tomorrow to increase that loyalty. Like the expectation is that I can now go back into the um oh, that's cool, so they will sort of come and claim it. Well, let's go and actually do I need to to do anything down here to plant something? There we go. Water. Oh, that's just a task? Alright, cool. So maybe I'll go back in. Um, let's talk to 
one of these guys. We can't ask you to water. The red section of a day means. I think it is funny coming from a playing something like oxygen not included and saying I need water and I'm like, all right, what elaborate path do I have to go to get water? Oh, you just you just click water and it waters them. Great. Steal all his stuff. Apparently, <laughs> come along, grab his stuff. All right, let's head home. Uh, let's go a run through the. For a run through our um, here at night. Lightning quick. All right. That is quick. Knocks back enemies within range while also damaging them. All right. I assume that's going to be like an area of effect. Seem like I've got a good weapon for uh, finding something like that's going to be spiky. start here. Thank you for giving me health. Back. Oh, the whole gang's here. Definitely will be swapping to a different weapon if they uh, if they offer it. Very close range. The other problem seems to be that when I hit guys, they sometimes sort of bounce back from uh, from getting hit. So that sort of second swing isn't going to hit them anyway. Once you're down to a couple of guys, it's not too bad. The comp, it's a decent complement. Um, the area of effect with it, though. Okay, cool. So I can give that to someone if I need to increase that uh, that loyalty. Use my AoE a second time quick there and it didn't seem to kick in, so I was looking at the top trying to work out if there was a cooldown or something on it. And what I'll credit with getting hit a couple of times there, trying to work out if I was um if I was being impatient with it. 
Right, I've got those decorations as well, I guess, that I can um, put up somewhere too. Seems like the... So what's that telling me, that picture there? Is it saying health and a, and a sword? House. That way I get a follower. Oh, I can still get to that from this. I want to go food. I'm not going to be completely convinced so I've got all the... As much food as I need. We'll just, um... This time around we'll just go for that. Plenty here. Let's give me a lot more of those seeds that I can plant too. Um, I wonder if I need more than one seed, like each time they, um, they grow, if I need to, um, replant, or if it's, that they'll just sort of continue to, to grow newer and new, new plants. Let's see what the health thing is here, we can work out what our additional bonus is. Feeling a bit, bit beat up there. Got a nice wide berth on this guy. Thank you. I needed that extra heart. Hits, especially with this quick little hitting weapon. I'm messing around with that one. <laughs> we're, not, we're not kidding around, guys. Let's just power through. Okay, so is that the two things? Tens of poisoning enemies while attacking. Yeah, I don't mind that one. And I don't mind my um area of effect damage, so glad to take that. It is a bit definitely slower than what I was moving before, but And it's obviously not a completely guaranteed poison hit. Not only will you no longer be scared soon, you also won't be a hedgehog. Okay. For that sweet devotion. And a little bit more of that sweet stone. sort of does more damage but I lose my poison. I don't mind that. I actually will take that. For how sparingly I sort of use my um, special abilities, I feel like I'm going to use it on a boss so I may as well hold out till I am um, fighting a boss. Blast two, but I'll stand by my choice. What's your story? Uh, 
It does feel like I'm just going to move to the other side of the map. Getting a little bit braver and hitting him. See if I can get three hits in there before I have to flee. accurate with that thing. Wild. That's a creepy head. Blueprint. Nuggets. Let's take the necklace. This I know what the use of that is at the moment. So, it's marker three, so it means if I go through that a third time, we'll, um... Well, sorry, fourth time, we'll, uh, we should be able to progress through to something new, I guess. Speak to someone, wake him up. I don't really want to wake him up, do I? Day is it's morning at day four. Oh, I don't feel bad. Let's uh, let's. I need to use my thing first. All right, cool. So it seems that'll be good for my farming. Let's talk to you for a second. Well, firstly, yeah, we'll get you some food in a second. Firstly, let's um, give you a little blessing. That seems like a healthy gain we get from that. We need to feed the hungry. Let's steal some of my food. Uncool. Alright, but what we'll do is we might call it there for this one before we start jumping into the next next things. Thanks for watching. Any questions or comments, feel free to chuck them below. And until next time, catch you later. See ya.